Hey everybody, back with another video, and today I thought I'd do a quick video on the rocket heater, but a little different. We got a thermal imager here, and you can see the outline of the of the rocket heater that I built. I'm going to show you ex ex kind of explain the way this works. Is you see the very center of the screen? There's a square, and that is represented by the number that's at the top center. 311 degrees. It's about what the top of the the stove is reading. And then the bottom of the, the the screen, you'll see it says 50 to 312. That's reading the coldest to the hottest temperature. So right over here, it must be reading about 50 something degrees. And then where was the other one? It's reading 311, which is the top temperature. So it kind of just gives you all of the everything in the screen temperature, lowest to highest, and then the center is the number at the top. All right, so starting up here, you'll see this is the chimney going outside. And this is kind of nice. You can see how much is being uh, radiated onto the wall. See how it's, uh, it's a little warmer down below, uh, right around the heater. As you go up, it cools off. So the temperature of the stack going outside right at the 90 is 185 degrees. That little strip right there, that's uh, deceiving. That is a uh, metal uh, reflective tape. Right there is where the thermometer is located. But this pipe is reading 184. Okay, now we're right on top of the rocket heater here. It's reading 300 and 370. I think I got 3, 390 there somewhere, 396. Okay, so the stop, top of the... the, the uh, I think I said water heater, but the top of the uh, rocket heater there is running 380, 390 degrees. And as we go further down, there's a little change here. You can see it cools right off. Uh, that ring right here, this ring, is where the paint has wore, burned off. So that's raw metal. Once you get back down to where the, the uh, paint is again, it jumps back up. It's kind of goofy. Uh, maybe it loses its heat a lot faster with no uh, paint on it. But anyway, we, let's back up a little bit. Alright, so there's the side of the rocket heater. And we're slowly going down. The screen's changing because it's adjusting to what's in the screen. If I get this out of there, which is the the feed tube, 662 degrees. Let's get that out of there, then the whole screen will change. There we go. And then we can kind of see what the temperatures are all the way down to the bottom of the thing. 500 or 230. And then we start rolling right around the bottom, and this is the bottom base, which is sitting at 95, 90, lower and lower. There's the concrete. This is kind of cool. You can kind of see the amount of radiant heat coming out of it. The further away you get, the colder the concrete gets. I'll show you, I'll show you my foot. So there's a, see the concrete over here further away from the garage is a lot colder. Alright, so these are pretty cool. Let's uh, check this uh, rocket heater out. I thought everybody would get a kick out of that. Kind of see what's going on inside the rocket heater. Alright, well thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.